Here we have um, Sukis is coming up soon, and we're going to start selling a srogim, a srogim or for sure shviz, and you're not allowed to make business out of srogim. So what do people do? They do it's called havla'a. It means that, for example, over here, they sell lulav and you get the esrog for free. You buy a lulav and get a free esrog. And here he brings it down, shmita produce produced by means of havloi does not make its payment to mei shviz. Havloi is done by selling the shmita produce together with something else, with its value is swallowed or included in a higher price paid for the other object. No money is directly exchanged for the shmita item. Can you don't buy an esrog, you buy a lulav, and the esrog is included with the lulav. That's called havloi. One more aloche, we have over here. Although the money exchanged for Shmita food becomes sanctified, the original Shmita food remains special as well. They must still be eaten under conditions of Shmita sanctity. That means even though he went to go buy apples, for example, so the money also becomes Gdusha Shviz. Not only that, the apples are also Gdusha Shviz, and you have to eat the apples with Gdusha Shviz. Shakoach.